welcome back to another computer sluggish video. Have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button and click on the bell to get notified when I upload a new video. And check out my forum at computersluggish.com. In today's video, I will be showing you how to fix any lag issues you are having with your mouse. This can include your mouse taking a long time to go across the screen, or it could be just your mouse is not working properly. The first thing you need to do is just inspect your mouse's cable. Make sure there is no damage to the actual cable itself. Just make sure you can't see through the outer black sleeve and see any of the cable inside. Because if you can see a bit of damage to the cable, then straight away that might be your issue with your mouse. Also, the next thing to do is just lift up your mouse and just gently move it side to side and just listen to it and make sure you can't hear any parts inside the mouse moving around. If you can hear a weird noise inside your mouse then that might mean at some point unfortunately it has been knocked and that is your problem and you may also need a new mouse. The next thing if you are using a battery powered mouse then change the batteries just in case the batteries have gone slightly flat. If the batteries are going flat then the mouse will have a lot of delay and lag. So definitely just make sure your batteries are new in the mouse and then give it another go to see how well the mouse performs. The next thing to do is also try a different mouse. If you have another mouse in your house or wherever you are, just plug that mouse into your computer and then that way you can rule out if it is your mouse or your PC. If the mouse that you have just plugged into your PC is working on another PC or laptop but it isn't working on your machine then you know that could be an issue with the USB slot that you just plugged the mouse in. So go ahead and try a different USB slot and then see if it works now. If it does work then you know unfortunately that USB slot that you just plugged the mouse in is not working properly. The next thing we need to do is right click on the start menu icon and you now need to click on settings and we now need to click on devices and you now need to select mouse on the left hand side here. We now want to go ahead and click on additional mouse options and we now need to click on pointer options and you now need to untick the enhance pointer precision option and press apply. Now see if that has helped your mouse issue. If you are having a problem with your mouse being too slow across the screen, go ahead and turn this option up here, which is under pointer speed, and you will notice your mouse is a lot faster. And that will resolve, hopefully, your mouse slowness problem. I'm going to go ahead and turn that down because I cannot control that. And as you can see, if you turn that all the way to slow, I can barely move the mouse at all. You want the mouse roughly in the middle. If changing these two options didn't help your problem, then the next thing we need to do is go ahead and open up the start menu and type in device. You now need to open device manager and we now need to open up mice and we now need to right click on our mouse and go to properties. You now need to go across to driver and you now need to select update driver and click search automatically for drivers and as you can see I currently have the best driver for my mouse. You can go ahead and search your mouse on Google and go to the manufacturer's website and just make sure they don't have any later drivers for your mouse as sometimes the manufacturer's websites do have newer drivers than what Windows supplies. We can now go ahead and press close and the next thing you want to do if it didn't find any new drivers is go ahead and hit uninstall device and go uninstall. This will now remove your mouse from your PC and all the drivers. As you can see, I don't have a mouse cursor on my screen at the moment, but now I need to go ahead and unplug my mouse and then plug it back in again. There we go. As you can see, mice has reappeared on device manager and it's installed the drivers for my mouse again. And I now have my mouse cursor back. 
hopefully that would have fixed your problem but if that didn't resolve your issue then the next thing to do is try changing the cable on your monitor I know that sounds silly but believe it or not this can actually cause a lot of issues when it comes to using the mouse go ahead and change the cable on your monitor if you do have a spare cable and see if that has helped if you don't have a spare monitor then just change the ports that the monitor cable is plugged into on your graphics card if you have a second slot for the HDMI or VGA or DVI whatever you are using plug the cable into that port and then see if that has helped if that hasn't helped then change the port that the cables plugged into on the monitor and then see if that has helped your mouse issue. If you're still having problems with your mouse on your PC or laptop then unfortunately that may mean that you need a new mouse but definitely go ahead and plug your mouse into another PC or laptop if you do have one to see if it works on those machines and if it does then it may even be that Windows has become corrupted for some reason and a reinstall on Windows may be required. But that is it for this video. If you have found a way to fix your mouse issue that I didn't say in this video, then please comment below and help everyone else out. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials. Don't forget to check out my social media channels and forum.